Hello YouTube, it's me, Natural Girl Next Door. Um, I said I was going to do a deep conditioner today. At first I said I was going to do the mayonnaise and the avocado mix one, but I watched my, um, <laughs> I had watched my New Year's resolution video, and on one part of it I said that I wanted to find products that just work for me and stick to them. So instead of doing that mix of, um, deep conditioner, I'm going to go ahead and use my deep conditioner from Butters and Bars. It's called Original Conditioning Hair Mask, and I'll show you what it looks like. And earlier, can you see that? Earlier I said that it's like a reddish color. Earlier I said that it's kind of messy, which it is. I mean, I don't know if it's messy or if I'm messy with it, you know? Um, so basically just now, I... I wash my hair, I wash and condition my hair with the Honey and Shea Shampoo and Conditioner from Butters and Bars. And right now I have nothing on my hair, it's just wet, that's all it is. And, um, oh, you know what, I don't have any ponytails with me down here. But anyways, I'm going to divide my hair into fours, going all the way down, and then from ear to ear. Um, my mom bought me this, like, little pick, like, uh, you know, rat tail thing. Um, I haven't used the pick yet, actually, but I'm about to use the rat tail part, rat, rat tail part, I don't even know if that's what you call it, to, um, split my hair. But, yeah, so, I'm not gonna sit here and show you how I put the conditioner on, because, I, I mean, Everyone knows how to put on conditioner. I'm just going to, I'm going to stop this video and then I'm going to, after I apply the whole conditioner, I'm going to do another video. Not do a new, another video, but, you know, continue on with this video. See you in a few. Okay, so these are the things that I need to do my deep conditioner. I got four ponytail holders. I got some clips. They're kind of big. I'm probably going to go back to the um, local corner store and get some more small ones. I have four, but oh, my hair broke one. I have a water bottle. Of course, I have the deep conditioner. I showed you guys earlier I had the comb. And I have a towel, which normally would be around my neck. However, since I'm messy with this conditioner, it's over the sink. Because I don't want my mom to yell at me again. I had it everywhere. Um, oh yeah. Not that I'm going to, um, detangle. However, it's just in case I have my big comb. I don't detangle my hair until I put, like, a leave-in conditioner or something in it. Most people conditioner, con oh, most people detangle their hair with, um, in the shower with the conditioner in, but, um, I get really itchy easily. You know, I can't be in the water that long. But anyways, um, I'm sorry if I look kind of like tired, you know. I am. Um, like, I actually, I woke up at like 12 today. My sister, LaBella Natural, called me and woke me up. It's my mom's birthday, so. Um, yeah, I'll come back when I apply all of it, y'all. Okay. Okay, so I split my hair into four parts. I'm going to start with this one. And then this one. And then this one. And then this one, okay? Okay, YouTubers. Oh, camera almost fell. Um, on this container, it doesn't con it doesn't have instructions on how to use this. So I have to go to the. I mean, I've done this um, conditioner before, but you have to get the instructions off the internet on their website. So basically, it's said to leave that or this conditioner on for um, 30 to 60 minutes, and it says that uh, like a bag. It's optional. I, I always use bag. And it says if you want, you can leave it on overnight. Now, this thing, as you can see, it's like a reddish brown. And my hair is black, and I want it to stay black. Like, I'm not saying that's going to dye my hair or whatever. Because I'm not using it before, and it didn't dye my hair. But, I mean, I'm not too keen on leaving it on overnight. Maybe I'll do that with another conditioner. I don't know. My hands are all red and stuff. But, I, I, sorry, I usually take these out, because I just had it in four, so I can keep it separated, so I usually take these out, 
And I always like, I always wonder what I'd look like as like a redhead. Um, now I know it kind of just blends in with my face, and that's not really nice to me. And I think that um, there's nothing more powerful than a big or a small black afro. So I'm down with my natural hair color. Um, one of my subscribers on one of my videos, she said that my music was distracting in the background. And I, I apologize for that, y'all. I live in a house where there's like a lot of kids. And um, I could take a lot of noise, so I apologize for that. And I will tune the music down because I guess my words are more important than the music. What? And got one more to take down. I'm recording, yeah. That was my mother. I don't know if you guys heard what she said. And that is my father. Okay. Happy birthday! Can I have a hug? So yeah, I took down all my hair and I'm going to put it in a plastic cap. <laughs> oh my god, you guys see my little red afro? That's funny. It's cute. Okay, YouTubers. Um, I rinsed the conditioner out. I had it on for about two and a half hours. Um, yeah, and you don't have to, if you end up buying it, you don't have to leave it on that long. You can leave it on for like a minimum of 30 minutes. And it doesn't really have a maximum because, like I said before, it said that you can um, have it on overnight. So, yeah, I rinsed it out. And you remember, like, on the other, like, it was red. It was red in my hair. So, nothing happened to my hair. It's still pitch black, like I love. And my hair, you guys, it feels so soft. It's, like, really, really, really soft. Like, really soft. Okay, I'm going to try to do a 360 of the hair. Oh, of my head. Uh, I don't know if you can see, <laughs> um, but yeah, so I think that I probably will make this conditioner a staple in my um, hair care regimen because it is pretty good. Oh, and I don't know if I told you guys this before, but the conditioner is supposed to, it's supposed to be in there, it's supposed to be refrigerated because um, it's all natural and it doesn't have any preservatives in it. I mean, if you end up buying it, you can add your own preservatives in it, but I don't have a problem with it being in my refrigerator. So, yeah, just remember to, it doesn't say it on the actual container, but it says it's on the website. I wish it did say it on the container, too. So, if you buy it, just put it in the refrigerator so it doesn't mold. Oh, excuse me. Um, so, yeah, I do like it. My hair is super duper soft, so I'm probably going to end up buying it. I think I paid $8.99 for it. So, I'm happy with it, y'all. And I'm about to go to two strands with my hair right now. So, peace. Now, you're going to sign out. Thanks for subscribing. I think I have 36 or so, but thanks anyways, y'all. Peace.